My name is Demetrius Duval Brock. Everybody call me Dee Dee for short. And I've been working in meter reading for 25 years. When a lot of people think about CPS, they think about their bill and their meter read. When we go out there, we, we try to tell our guys is that it's important for them to establish some type of customer contact. Let the customers know that you're there. You know, you might have to yell out, meet a reader. But that customer come to, to know that and recognize that. And so it's more than just getting a read, it's helping the customer see that CPS energy is out there and dependable. I've been stung by wasps and bees so many times I can't remember. Dog bites, I stopped counting at 17. Guns, knives been pulled on me upwards of 10 or more times. It makes the job difficult, yet we still out there doing it. My name is Wade Harrington. I do the market research here at CPS Energy. Well, market research means that you want to find out what the customer is thinking about, what, how they feel about the company, and how they react over time, because this is a very complex uh, business, and there's a, lots of moving parts to it. And we provide a service that uh, a lot of people sometimes don't even pay much attention to until something happens. And then we need to very quickly respond to that. And we want to make sure that our own customers are happy with us, not just how good everybody else is doing or how, how poorly they're doing. So we've got Bear County, and that's where our customers are. And we are, we do, we, we service them, we plow the money back into the community, so we have a lot of efficiencies that way. My name is Raul Flores, and I work here at CPS Energy in customer contact in the call center. I answer calls um, for any reason. Uh, it could be assisting one of our lead representatives, um, answering questions for upper management, um, helping uh, a customer with an issue on their account. When you call CPS Energy, uh, the first thing you're going to get and the first person you're going to talk to is a representative. And depending on what your request is or um, what you're needing to know, um, we will route the call to the right person to help you with your question. We want to always give um, the customer complete uh, satisfaction. Um, some calls may be longer than others, but we want to be sure our ultimate goal is to make sure that our customer is satisfied at the end of that call. Uh, it's not just about explaining their bill, it's, it's informing them and educating them of what CPS has to offer to help them. And if we can help them one by one as a community, we all win. My name is Lori Nario and I work in the outage management system at CPS Energy. The outage management system is an interactive map that we have of the entire service area of San Antonio. It is able to provide us information of where our customers are out of power and able to provide us information where our crews are out in the field and to let us know which one would be available to help them out. Currently we have an outage map on our CPS Energy website and if you were able to get on there from any computer that you have available, you can find information about what outages are out in our service area. Um, you can click on there and you can actually see what time an outage is restored. Um, and if you don't see that there's any outages out there, then you have the option to call in and find out um, if your outage is actually being posted into our system. CPS Energy works for you. What that means to me is we're trying to do what the customers are asking from us. We're trying to provide them more information out there. We're trying to help them understand our system a lot better. Um, we're providing anything that we can we're really out there for what the customers are asking for. To be a part of an organization that's going out and help the community and all the various facets that's done, to be a part of that means a lot. We are community owned and we are for the community and let's face it, that's the most important reason that we're supposed to keep our, our customers happy because uh, it's the right thing to do. 